is a little ticked off as you hear Dana White cheering on his man. This is and, and being a, 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 if I may, if I may, what happened here, boss? I know it's not me, so uh, uh, we're down to one. I only hope that Chuck doesn't find out that you so-called armbarred him, what you said in the opening of the show. Well, I hope for you he doesn't find out. Let's just keep in mind, I didn't write that, baby. All right, the referee going over the instructions here. And again, our first fight of the evening. Hai 57-993. Halfway down as Alistar is trying to get back up and does that as the two are in the clinch. And when he gets up, boss, he can throw those knees. And he throws them really well. They separate again now, and the fans cheer that here. Oh, and there's a combination there with that left cut. knee. Yes, he is cut. He is cut above the right eye. No question one of those knees was able to get in. Good block of the kick there. That's why we brought in one of the best cut men in the country, uh, Don House, to work in the corner. We, we anticipated a possible cut with the good knees, and uh, we brought a great cut man in. It looked like that left knee also got in. Maybe, perhaps, Chuck was able to catch it sooner. Yes, it, it got in, but um, Alistair should have tried to stay on his feet. I think Chuck li still was a little hurt. Now it's going to be Chuck's game, I think. It looks good for Alistair the way he tries to pummel up right now. But this position you don't want to be in. Look at here. Now, Chuck, Chuck's waiting the knees now. Absolutely. Chuck's turn. Chuck's opportunity to get some knees in. And, you know, with the knees that flew early, I would think Chuck may be a little more favoring the ground as he is getting the knees here. Yes, for sure. This is a real good position for Chuck. Uh, north side position. You uh, can see the blood across the right side of his mohawk there, and then down trickling to his eye on Chuck Liddell. Right there, he's got a good opportunity to throw some good knees. Those long arms, though, really good at blocking those knees. Yes, and Alistair shoot. And there's a block the back right door. There. He makes a left hand, a left turn, and he can swing out of this because Chuck only has one other hook. He can swing it out if he wants to. Right. But he's got to get up. He's got to get up. Don't wait for this. Dana has called exactly as you see several knees blocked there by Alistair. Star, and he's able to stand up where again he'll be in a position now that he can throw those knees to the body. And I think now he's got the oh, he's getting away from it. Okay, he gives him some distance. Chuck with a left hook and another. Alistar missing with a right. The two now back toe to toe, if you will. Oh, and there's a knee to the body, another, another knee. Body. A counter with the right hook by Chuck Liddell. Oh, and another left. Who looks to be a little hurt right now. He looks like he is hurting a little bit, but I'm sure he has been in these situations before, Dana, and bounced back. He's got a lot of good experience, and he really does have a good chin and good recovery power. He saw that when he fought Guy Mesger. Mesger rocked him early, too. And looking closely into his eyes, I mean, he looks like everything is ready to go, and he may, you know, maybe he's just adjusting to the style of fight that he is facing here tonight. It's tough fighting a big, long-rangey guy like that that can block everything you do and has a lot of reach on you. But again, nothing we didn't anticipate, and we'll see what happens there. Yeah, he's able to block a few of those hooks there by Alistar. And Alistar missing there. It looks like Alistar in this 10-minute round came out with a lot of adrenaline. Looks like he is a bit yeah, tired. Looks like no he got a little rock it. there, too. Two rights, and three oh, oh, right there. Two rights, right 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 three rights. Stand a knee. This could be the end of the fight. Hurt. now. Oh, 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 A comeback, and I said a moment ago when it looked like he was hurt, I took a closer look at his eyes, and his eyes looked like they were fully coherent, fully ready to go. And Alistar was dazed. Oh, and he was lucky also because we don't know how big that cut was. He started to work, he felt the cut was good, maybe be affected later on. And there he came with the punches, the double right straight, he set it up. And then with the rest combination, he finished it up. And now he walks over and gives Alistar Overeem a hug and kind of a bit of credit, saying what a fabulous performance it was. The knees did Dana get to White. Chuck. Dana White now hugging him. Here we go, the double right straight, I think. Here it is, though. No, right oh right no, there to the, the forehead. One. Absolutely. Ooh. And he can see he's got him hurt. You can see he's wobbling. Yeah. And then Chuck went in for the kill.
And yep. that knee right there, the left knee, and that right cross, and that right now hook. No, the left who comes, that's it. It's definitely. It was that first right hand to the forehead that did most of the damage. And look at that right there. Alistar beautiful was hit. out on his feet. Very impressive Chuck Liddell. He was confident all week. He never had any doubts in his mind that he oh, would be able to look do at this. this. He wanted oh, to say hello to his girlfriend, Summer, who I'm sure is much happier to get the message right now. Because yes. even though he is bleeding, he is smiling, baby, and loving life. Just a tremendous performance. It really looked like he was in trouble. But as we were saying to Dana White at that moment, I'm sure he's been in this situation before and he's got a strong chin. Yes, and he is. Now look at there, you know how Dana White, very happy. Yeah, obviously everybody happy. What a performance. He's opened it up in the double right straight and then he starts finishing the whole thing up. I tell you, boss, no question this one showed all of what pride is about because both fighters momentarily looked like they had control. Alistar's control was fleeting. Chuck's was for real. But the pride came out in both fighters. And it certainly looked like throwing those knees early. Maybe this was part of Chuck's game plan. But it looks like it's, there's that right hand again. It looked like Alistar just got winded throwing those knees. No question about it. it yes, he got winded. And there's Chuck Liddell coming over now to say hello to Dana White. Just a tremendous win and he's asking for more uh, water it looks like or so oh. he's asking to he's gonna make some phone calls and he told me he told me after the fight who he would call first I asked him I believe he would uh, call his his brother and let them huh. tell all the uh, tell all the details but a tremendous tremendous win for Chuck Liddell